Apple is putting Siri into a home speaker. Apple sees a whole new role for the virtual assistant. KPI X5's Kit Doe has a story. You could make a strong case that the show stealer at today's keynote is the so called HomePod. And if you believe Apple, this is not your grandfather's music speaker. It features an array of high frequency speakers on the bass surrounding a four inch subwoofer that's pointed upward. What's more, it has what Apple calls spatial awareness, where it detects the shape of the room and then directs the sound of vocals and instruments in the proper direction. The goal is a full, rich mix that fills up a room. The audio and the speakers on Echo and the Google Now are really tinny. They're not really made to do great sound. Apple takes this up a notch. And to be really fair, it's a sound system first that just happens to have Siri. Tech analyst Tim Beharin says for now, it is not a direct competitor to the Amazon Echo. This is not an Amazon Echo killer. Well, I wouldn't call it that because, again, even though it does what Echo does, it's designed really as a powerful room speaker. For iPad lovers, this is a big deal. Apple has upgraded the iOS and added a new functionality where you can drag and drop single or multiple files into folders, making organizing your data more like a desktop. What this suggests is that Apple is now giving even more love to the iPad and making it even more productive, productivity as well as consumer product. And so the drag and drop functionality for the iPad is available to developers now, but it'll be for customers later on this fall. And then the HomePod is coming out this fall. The cost is $349. In downtown San Jose, Kitto, KPIX5.